previously, before the Fire Nation attacked. You're so arbitrary on whether to like call out fortifies or not. Like sometimes you're like, yeah, I'm gonna do it. Sometimes you're like, nah, fuck it. So uh, then, oh no! <laughs> Well, I guess you have to this time. I was the one who told you to do that. God fucking damn it. I already uh, called it. I was like, we already know we're going to accidentally... They better not be in love. They better not be... Okay, thank God they're not in no. love. I'm worried. And now, let's continue where we left off. Which is okay, but it doesn't make him nearly as overkill. He's still going to cruise through the arena. But yeah. instead of like... If, if Arthur would become another kid to set up kills for, rather than a kid that like just gets kills on his own. Yeah. And that's bad. That's that's the main difference. Because Tinny, you're gonna have to set up kills for either way. She's yeah. always gonna be garbage. I think I'm, what I'm gonna do here is I'm gonna dance here. Okay, so we're leaving this village for Jamka, right? Yeah. Yeah. And then we can do Luan. We can dance for Luan and Tilt you, I suppose. Actually, yeah. If I no, this is ID. Yeah, you might want to stop using Physic now because you might need it at some point. Yeah. I'm Although Claude is also here to fortify. Yeah. So maybe we shouldn't care. I don't think we should care. There we go. But yeah, no, it, no, it's nice to save a couple of physics uses. We, it only has tender abilities. It's not that spammable, really. You have, you have two left, so yeah. Yeah. There we go. God, I love moving through forests. It's my favorite aspect of Fire Emblem 4. If you hold, like, your 50,000th poll in the channel, whether you should cut things out or not. <laughs> it's not gonna <laughs> Maybe work. they'll answer differently this time. Alright, so what do we do here? Do we just, like, blaze through, or...? I think those guys move. Oh, they do? I think so. So, uh, kills for Beowulf, I guess. Or for... I think Sigurd is already, like, gonna level cap. He's probably going to level cap, yeah. But if I, if I use a Javelin, then he's not gonna... Kill anything, though. No. He'll just weaken them, which is actually exactly what I want, so... It's exactly what I wanted all along! Yeah! Okay, so let's see. Now we're at... Turn 8. I don't know how long this chapter is going to take, like, turn-wise. Probably around 40, maybe? Ah, it shouldn't be that long. It's actually not that... It's not that long if you use the Warp Staff to get everyone down. If you, like, if you forget about the turns where you spend doing absolutely nothing because of the cutscenes... Yeah. ...then it should be, like... Oh, yeah, that takes like, some time. That takes, like, <laughs> three turns, I think. Can that screw with speedruns? Uh, no, I doubt it. Like, the, the time it takes for the cutscene to be over is not that RNG-dependent because of that one thing that happens mid-battle. Oh, yeah. No, but isn't it, like, depending on who the character's targets and stuff, can't it, like, vary a little bit? I don't know. If if it does, it's, like, one turn. Like, okay. this game isn't, like... I know you said speedruns usually mean, like... Yeah, L I, 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 meant, I meant LTC. I meant LTC, not speedrun. Like, I'm pretty sure that... I don't remember Velka about complaining about this, so it can't be a big deal. Basically. <laughs> Valkama didn't I think complain if, about if there's it. it. It's one turn, and that's it. Right, right, right. Valkama right. didn't complain, it doesn't matter. Yeah. Exactly. Okay. So that village is the one Sylvain needs to dance for, right? So no one's I'll, touching I'll it. I actually double checked it earlier, but let me see. So it's not that it's closest to Thove, but the, the one next to that. Hmm. So it's one left to the one that's closest to Thove. Is it the one the village is burning out? Is I think it's the one that's not burning, actually. Oh, okay, that's convenient then. Yeah, it's uh, money for Sylvia, I guess. Yeah. Uh, that's gonna cost you a bit of turns to get to, maybe. It is. Oh, nice. Kill from a deep. Uh, probably want the Brave Bow here. Yeah. I mean, if you want to kill him, yeah. <laughs> That'd be nice. <laughs> Killing him would be good. You know, Paragon ring nice. uh, works best when you kill enemies. <laughs> that's uh, usually what it does. That's, that's how it's used most effectively, contrary to popular belief. <laughs> contrary to what's been demonstrated in this playthrough. Hey, I don't. I've used the Paragon Ring well. I mean, you manage to kill things in the arena with it, but any dummy can do that. Hey, mm. it's I'm not trying to think like. I'm trying to think, what if we uh, you seize Thov, and then you have Sylvia walk backwards to the village, and then you return her on your way back with Aranus or something. And that way you won't have to um, wait for Sylvia to come back from it or something. Alternatively, how about I weaken this? How about I weaken this guy a little bit with Arden so that uh, Noish can kill him with a thief sword? Sure. What else is Arden, Arden getting do? anywhere anyway? What is uh, what else is Arden gonna do? He's gonna chill. Netflix and chill. He's gonna Netflix and chill. There we go. 
Hey guys, remember mounted units? <laughs> I don't, because they've been gone for so long. <laughs> they've already been gone so long on these road tiles. <laughs> Wait. You guys, remember when terrain was supposed to balance like horse? horse, are we, horse what, are we do, what are we doing? What are we doing? Right? Uh, yeah, she is, isn't she? Yeah, with Lowen. Oh, or or she can go south and then get one village, or she can go up and get two. Hmm. Hmm. And she can also get a kill if we can a guy with Arden. Yeah, let's do that. Excellent idea. Okay, so they're still not in so love. Wait, do you, does Sidine still have a tome? Because then you can maybe weaken that. Uh, oh yeah, I can. That lower pirate with her. <laughs> only a direct holy descendant can inherit the full breath of the power of the gods, and only they'll be able to wield their family's divine heirlooms. However, if kin intersects, their offspring will have their exalted blood enriched and will reap almighty powers. Needless to say, mine doing, don't, doing that is condemned and forbidden. Genealogy condones incest, everyone. Yeah. No, it Actually, I think the old one was... Uh, no, I know. Uh, wait, I think the... wait, wait, wait. Fourth, yeah. Oh, good, good, good. The old one was a lot more funny. I think he said yeah. something along the lines of oh, like, "Oh yeah, oh, oh, oh yeah." I was very excited about the whole yeah, aspect like, of it. Oh, so that would be very taboo if you did that. Yeah, oh. he wink, wink. It's like I, I think it would be a lot better actually. Okay, I think that so might. Probably... I know you're like very paranoid about someone dying, but yeah. if you leave this guy alive, I'm pretty sure you can get the kill with Medir, and he won't kill anyone with your. Then I also but you'll can't... help the whole back, yeah. Yeah, I don't want to do that. Well, uh, fuck you then. <laughs> you can debate him in Deuce range even if he wants to and steals gold. Uh, but it's no. probably not worth the turn loss. I don't <laughs> think it is. I think I'm just going to kill this guy with a cell. Is it also one who needs a kill still? Mm, he's level 25. He's a little bit. Close. I mean, he it doesn't hurt, right? Well, you don't know that. If he reaches, le like, if someone reaches level 30 without help at this point, then it does hurt. I guess. It does like, it doesn't bit. hurt Lacazus to get, like, 20 XP from killing an enemy, but someone else could have gotten it. Yeah. Yeah, I, I think we just need to, like, look, go to the, uh, go to our units and just see who needs this. Actually, doesn't this guy have, like, a blizzard? Yeah, he fucking does. He does, but he's the only one. Actually, yeah. he's not. I think the other guys have blizzard, too. Yeah, I just seem to recall. Fuck. It's fine. They have, like, shit hit on you. And the wolf is gonna get a lover bonus, right? And everything it's actually, else. It's a cell I'm worried about, actually, but, yeah. What does he have equipped? Elwind? Elwind, yeah. It's fine. You're gonna give him charisma and leadership? Is he in a forest too? No, he isn't, right? He is. No, he's on the plains, actually. But yeah, you're probably right. Oh, he's on the road, actually, I think. Yeah, that's, <laughs> that's not great. Uh -huh, uh -huh. I actually uh, think he, uh, he has enough avoid. Or enough resistance to survive three hits. 31, 27. No, he doesn't. I'm a Ten moron. Rest? Oh, he has 58 points. Never mind. I keep forgetting that Holy Blood characters actually have a lot of hit points. Uh, 31, that guy's gonna do 21 then. Okay, and the other guys have... Oh, right, that triggers the event. Hmm, I'd say those traders are drawing perhaps a bit too close for comfort. You there, raise the Thobe River drawbridge. Without this key, there's no way they'll ever get over here. Hey, <laughs> I almost wish I could see the looks on their faces. Or they could see the look on mine. How am I twirling my mustache? Didn't he say, like, in the original, like, haha, they don't have a thief or something, or am I misremembering that? Uh, I'll remember that. I remember a village gives you a hint about a thief unlocking the thing. <laughs> Makes sense. If you're in a blizzard guy, just move backward. Just uh, have your horse move a couple steps and it'll that's, be fine. That's how I avoid blizzards in Norway. I just walk yeah. backwards. Personally, I prefer to stay inside or yeah. not go to Norway, but whatever <laughs> works for you. Pitfalls. Pitfalls. Wow, clever mode focuses targets. Yeah, I love how you keep saying it, but we have seen zero evidence of it so far. Sometimes <laughs> keep it saying, it's clever like... mode, so I know what I'm doing. Oh, well, didn't we sort of conclude that we don't really know what clever mode does? Yeah, but you keep still talking as if you do know what clever mode does. I don't know what clever you're, mode you're, does. In your guide, your guide, Mang's voice. <laughs> clever mode is really clever. What it does is well. What no do you know about clever things anyway? I, I, I'm a very, I run a very clever YouTube channel. Oh, do you have a second channel? <laughs> Mang's plus, yeah. Um, I don't, th that's the one thing I'll never understand. People who make second YouTube channels, like, ugh, I, I don't get it. I really don't get it. Shots fired at Blazing Night. Sounds boring. I get it. I get that they want their main channels to be like. A, like Give gold! Oh my god, they're in love! Huh? Oh fuck. <laughs> god damn it, Mecca, I actually thought you were legit. I was like, oh my god, they're actually in love! Yay! <laughs> oh, Arden's such, at such a perfect level here. I love yeah, that. Yeah, you can hit the guy twice, and then he's good. So, 
I thought he crit. Um, if, <laughs> if, uh, <laughs> however... Forever. He's just slow. Don't make fun of Artem for being slow, man. Isn't That's this 5,000 gold that we will never get, though? I mean, you don't have to kill him right now. You can get the other village first. I guess. Wait for yeah. Norse to make his way over. I think I would prefer that. Wow, Sylvia is doing so well right now. I mean, Levin and Tiltu have to make their way back to uh, the main castle, and um, Tiltu needs to be in position to, like, grab some civilians when they come out, so... It's okay for her to not get any further on the main road, basically. Just get sure, the village. I can, yeah, I can go back. Yeah. And uh, just gotta dance for Adine first. She's such an important character to have around, you see. Yeah, just put her next to her sister. I know what you're yeah. looking for. You, you were aroused by the guy's suggestion to do incest. I know you were. <laughs> ho, 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 I'm the old man in the village. <laughs> uh, isn't that a jealousy Nog. formation, though? With Adine and Bridget? I don't know if people who are already in love can do, like, do jealousy, but... Hmm. That's, uh... No, 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 no. I, I don't... I wouldn't think so. But You put two girls next to each other next to a guy. That's never a good idea, I agree. Um, anyway, I think I just wanna... Okay, I, two I, people, good. Three people, cut out it. Oh yeah, hor horrible, horrible. Cut out it. You know that uh, movie? Uh, no. Like, uh, Tom Hanks gets stuck in an airport or something. Oh, really? Yeah, but I forgot what it's called. <laughs> Why is he holding a Slims? Oh, it's because he has a blistered tome, right, right? Yeah, he's like, to make sure that he doesn't get one race with the blizzard tome equipped. The... Oh, he adapted me! Oh, you got adapted by the Slim Sword. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. Strong. Wait, wait, wait. Um, yeah, I actually wonder. There is a funny bug in this game. Uh, if your if your speed goes slow. so, right. So adept has twenty percent twenty percent plus speed, right? Let's say this guy had adept. Um, he would oh yeah, the game can a, freeze if you have. Yeah, the a, game can freeze if you, if if, uh, if yeah if your if your yeah if your effective speed your adept proc goes below zero and they attack, you actually freeze the game, which is only if they will proc adept. I think actually no, because it doesn't matter because the the game tries to calculate the chance. And it yeah, the, the game rolls a number and then it's like oh the result is minus three and then it just what the fuck do I do? And uh -huh. It just freaks out or something. It's really funny. Okay. Um, um, wait. Yeah, you actually made a, a a jealousy formation. I think. Did I? <laughs> Yeah, but only if you've reset the game at least once, so I'm I... not sure if it counts here. Because Idine actually has higher priority than anyone else for doing Jemka. Really? So she will steal the love points, oh. even if she's like already in love. I'm actually not sure how that works. Uh, actually, no, I'm not for sure that it works, because uh, Ethan was able to provide jealousy, so I know that uh, Idine That's also works. That's funny. Actually, I don't know if it works, because for Ethan it was the other way around. We had to donate extra love points, basically. Maybe I just did the opposite, that'd be funny. I guess we'll find out if if Adine falls in love with Dew and like breaks up with Madir. <laughs> uh, if you could make Adine like get the brave boat to someone and have her break up and get the rescue staff to claw. Do you think it's safe to? I'm just gonna leave. Do you think it's safe for me to put Alec here, even though he has he's, he has leadership and charisma range? So that's six. Put him in the forest. Uh oh yeah, oh yeah, I could do that. Yeah. <laughs> But I don't want to move Lex further ahead, because... Uh, no, he, there's he no only point take... anyway. Yeah, he only take... I don't want him to take that. Uh, Madir, on the other hand, that I'm fine with. Actually, Madir can probably, if I put him in... Uh, let's see... If only there was a way for me to know how many hits he took. Uh, 43, yeah, he's his resistance blows. I, I don't want him to take two blizzards, that's too scary for It'd me. be so nice if you could get a kill here, though. It would, but I just don't want to risk it. Because... The next opportunity. What do we do to... with Jamke now? Is he ever gonna see action? Should we just walk down with him? Um. Yeah, I guess he just walks home or something. Like maybe. Um... No, there's no point in positioning him ready for the next thing because there's gonna be plenty of turns to do that with everyone else. Jamke doesn't want to be in front of that whole thing. I think thing I want to go this scene. road with Noish because there's less trees. Yeah. So you decided to get the uh, the upper pirates gold then? Yeah. Yeah. Okay. That's what I decided. Wait, but you weaken him with Arden, so you're gonna get the kill with Noish then. That's fine. And not, not tilt you. Oh fuck! Yeah, you're right. I'm I'm a moron. Oh well. Well, tilt you, tilt you can still get some civilians to get to level 15. Oh, but aren't we gonna give those civilians to do? Like he really needs to promote. Yeah, that's my point. Is like any civilians you will give to uh, do cannot go to tilt you or vice versa. But tilt you still has the arena, arena ring paragon thing, and she's level 10 right already. Yeah, she's gonna get a crap ton of experience out of that. And we're, go we're also gonna leave the Paragon Ring on her, so she'll get to do that next chapter as well. Yeah. And if she's like, over yeah. level 15, she can clear the arena pretty easily, right? Oh fuck, I forgot about that guy. Holy shit, that could've really fucked me over. <laughs> 
Okay, but if you want to leave the, the arena, the Paragon Ring on Tilt you, you can't actually arena with her until very late in the chapter. Because mm. yeah, a lot of people still have to buy the Paragon Ring first. Okay, you don't want to yeah. have to buy it twice with Tilt you. I just realized that I need to wait for Dew to get to that bridge before anyone yep. can do shit, so... Joke's You're on correct. me, I guess. Don't you think we should use Sylvia to speed? Actually, I don't think she's close enough to speed it up. How is she Actually, ever gonna uh, speed it up? We can, uh, if we place a guy on the other side here, we can pull a lot of these javelin guys. This is true. You can get started on uh, killing the enemies at least. That's gonna take a little bit. Yeah, I think I want to do that. Fortunately, there's no safe way to do it with Madir. No. Uh, he just kills them. <laughs> that really does suck. Um, all right, so we'll move Levin here. Tilt you here. Yeah, Tilt 2 I think is fine as long as she gets the Paragon Ring for both arenas, because she only needs to be level 15 for the next chapter. Right. There we go, no. <laughs> Don't, yeah. want Don't want to return. That would have been great. So, um, technically, who who do we want to be up here when we seize this castle? I, I guess Ira doesn't really matter. I usually like, leave Lex behind there. It's too hard to guard. You mean like to guard it when it's like... Destroyed? No, I mean like, I mean, we're, we're not going to need everyone to be up here. No. Who, sh who should we leave up here? Um, I mean, I guess Azel is pretty good against the Armor Knights. Uh, as yeah. long as he survives, of course. Could work, yeah. No, they have Elwyn, so actually we do. We want to use Elwyn against these if we want to. Actually... You need Elwyn to double. Yeah, but do we want to double? I guess I want to get rid of them. Uh, they don't move, but the Blizzard is annoying. The Blizzard is annoying. I think I'm just gonna do this. Um, so what are you gonna there's... do about the pirate? I don't know. Kill him or... You can get a paragon kill with Madir now if you want to, or you can leave him and then steal his gold with uh, Noish. But I think... it takes Noish forever to get there. It does. Actually, I can't kill him this turn. No, but like Noish is not gonna be here next turn. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I guess you're right. Mm. Yeah, Beowulf I don't know. Is... Beowulf is fine, right? He He's oh, level he 24. He's level 24. He could get a couple kills. That wouldn't be the worst. Um, a couple kills is like nothing for a character at this point, though. You got like 10 XP for that, didn't you? I did. So, do we just play Sigurd with a Javelin and start weakening these Armor Knights and then have someone else come and kill them? I like that. You can have... Um, yeah, if Sigurd weakens them and then moves to another tile and then Medir kills them and cancels back, Medir can safely get kills. Yeah, that'd be cool. And we need to wait a couple turns anyway, right? So there's no point For in Dewey, not yeah. Yeah. So we could do that. 69. Uh, 69. Good job. Thank you. So we'll do this. Actually, the Armor Knights don't count, though, so they're not going to, like, pile up here. I guess this we could true. send... Uh, we could start sending Aira and Holin back, and we can, like, return them with Eren. Uh, like, I don't mind that. So wait, I got to make sure that... Yeah, okay, cool. good job. <laughs> I think, I think uh, the I bridge think... is like, it counts as a road, I think. Not sure, though. Uh, it might, actually. It reduces your avoid like a road does, but I'm not sure. Wow, I'm <laughs> no. glad you moved Ardeen all the way up here. I'm glad, too. Okay, so what do we do then? Just have Sylvia move this way, then, I guess? Uh, well, she still needs to get the Defender at some point. Oh, you're right. Holy crap, she does. But I'm glad you wasted her move by moving that way. Fuck me. Because the sooner you do it, the sooner you can return her with Eren. Yeah, I'm dumb. And make use of her. So. I'm dumb. Next turn. Next turn. Okay. Yeah, so, wait, is Sigurd gonna kill all these guys? I don't know, that sounds like something he could have checked. <laughs> he doesn't kill. <laughs> no, he doesn't. My god. So I'm gonna I... turn my lights on one second. Okay. So I guess hmm, we can put Medir. Okay, yeah. So no one, well, no one else will actually move until Dew gets into position. So that's actually fine. Hmm. Think. Okay, that village is gonna burn down. It's not much I can do about that. So I guess what we do then is we attack uh, this guy with Noish. Just give him a kill. Hopefully he hits. That would be really bad if he didn't. Don't miss this, Noish. Please don't miss this. Thank you. There we go. 5,000 gold obtained. And then I guess we just return Arden? Yeah, let's just return Arden. Why not? 
There we go. Micah takes forever to fucking turn off his light switch. If he LTC the light switch as good as 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 good as he plays Fire Emblem, we'd have no issues. All right, there we go. The Salisian royal family wields the power of wind as bestowed by the wind god for Seti. House Volthomer wields the power of fire as bestowed by the fire goddess Vala. And House Frege wields thunder powers as bestowed by the thunder god Tordo. Very interesting conversation right here. So, like, I don't know why they talk so much about holy blood in this chapter. It's really weird. Really weird. Uh, Alright, so we can do this. And I think I'm just gonna return all of these guys. A little bit sad about the Sylvia thing. That was kind of dumb. I should probably start moving her this way. But hey, there's not much I can do about that right now. Uh, there we go. And I'll also move Ira down here. And we're gonna keep Claude in range of Sylvia. Because we want them to fall in love. And I guess Arden goes on car castle duty. That's what he's gonna do for the foreseeable future. And I think, I mean, I want the gold on this guy, but at the same time, do really needs that progress. He really does. So I'm not sure if I want to, like, waste a turn with do. It's actually a really tricky choice. I don't know. I'm a green unit. Hey, Mecca, so do you think it's worth it to spend a turn to have Dew steal that pirate's gold? It's 5,000 gold. It's a lot. Um... But can he... Oh, he can't make it to the lock. Wait, can he even make it to the lock next turn? I don't think he can make it to the lock next turn. Uh... No. He cannot. Okay, oh, he's spent like three more turns instead of two That more means turns. I can do this with Madeir. Yeah, but if he goes there, he probably dies. You think so? Well, his resistance is garbage, and he can run around and kill everything that comes there. Oh, the Wind Mage, you mean? Well, um, yeah, he's gonna face like two Wind Mages and like two more Armor Knights, right? What if I use a Killer Bow and hope I won't crit? Uh, uh, I think it's worth it to that guy's gold. How much gold does, does Dew have at this point? Not that much at all. Yeah, I know it's not much. 8,000. Wow, it's like nothing. Yeah, I know, right? Alright. Uh, why didn't you kill that guy, at least, with Madeir, the Armor Knight? Because I couldn't have cantoed back. It was at the edge oh. of his movement range. Oh, damn. I guess your uh, secret is in the wrong place then, because if you could have cantoed one space to the left, it would have been good. Yeah, that would have been Yeah, that would have been great, good, but that's oh. that didn't end up happening, so... That didn't end up happening. You talk as if it's the AI that moved secret there. <laughs> you know, sometimes things just don't go your way, you know? Yeah, sometimes units just end up the in wheel, the wrong positions the miraculously. The of fate you know, just about miraculously... It. Like, I was like, okay. <laughs> Oh well, yeah, they, they move in squads, of course. Oh, RIP VILLAGE! Move. It's okay, we stole more gold anyway. Plus, yeah, that don't... pirate will move around. You can maybe get to him more easily with someone. It's just so gold. funny that, like, the pirates are, like, the... Oh, actually, we could do, like, a bro Lex maneuver here if we want. Uh, I think the Brave Axe doesn't kill? No, it, it oh, yeah, does. Actually, it's it a does, 30 but... damage, dude. But the Steel Axe... Uh... Oh, doesn't no. do enough. Alec, maybe? Alec is the master of not killing things. He does uh, 28. That's a brave sword that probably kills like 16 times four. That's a kill, yeah. That's so, that's 28. 28 damage. plus hand axe, maybe. That's 24. Yeah, 24 plus 28. That's not a kill. 24 plus 28. Uh, yeah, that that adds up to the number not a kill. You're right. He. I'm just trusting you. I didn't do the math. <laughs> I know you didn't. That's Fuck! why. Fuck. Okay, I I can confirm now. Definitely, that it won't be a kill. God it's okay. Yeah. Lycus is probably the big, like, absolutely sure it's not a kill. Like, what does Lycus have again? Like, for weapons? A silver, silver bow. bow. Oh, that's definitely. Oh, Earth Sword. Earth Sword. Oh, Earth Sword. That's good, right? That's um, 42 damage. That's good. So he's gonna have 13 left. And do you do 13 damage? Uh, he does about 15 with the light sword. Ah. <laughs> what? <laughs> <laughs> Are you kidding me right now? Okay, but now you can soften him up with like Alec. Alec, Alec, yeah, yeah, yeah. God damn Alec. it, Ruckusis. You get like married, and this is how you. For I give you a handsome mercenary as a husband, and this is how you. This is how you reward me. Wait, this is a kill, isn't it? No, he has 14 times 2, which is 28. Oh, okay, okay. Just checking. Just checking that no mecha math makes its way into this LP, you know? <laughs> it's probably.
probably too late for that. <laughs> <laughs> All right, and then we'll do. Yeah, I think. And then we'll do. Yeah, you're correct. Then we'll do. I don't think that costs you a turn at all. I don't think it costs me a turn either, so that was everything according to Kaikaku. Hey. There we go. 5,000. Still, I guess he has enough for Paragon now, but I don't know if he can get past the first arena with... He actually like... doesn't. Yeah, he, does, he probably needs some kind of ring, but figuring out which ones he needs is going to be tricky. Yeah. Uh, okay, so Noish, I guess he can go down for the pirate now. Oh, the, the pirate is going to run away from the village? Yeah, I guess. Yeah. And then maybe, like, Tilt you can walk after. Oi. The sinister powers of the Dark God Loptir can be fought only with the glorious powers of Naga, our great god. Only Grain Whale's house, Balhalla, the heir to Saint Haim, inherits Naga's power. Okay. 500 obtained. Yay. How, how about I, we, uh, how about... To get this one. Oh, yeah, she needs a little bit more, actually. Oh, yeah, she needs this chapter. Yeah. Um... Hmm. Well, we can I can her. check if it's, if it's possible for Lewin to fall in love with her this chapter. Maybe that will help. That would definitely help. Because, I mean, we already want Tiltu to get it at the end of the chapter anyway, so it's fine if it takes forever. So I think I'm going to return, just start returning these guys now. Uh, yeah, sure. As long as you stay next to Noish, that's fine. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm planning to. Okay, so once again, Lewin and Tiltu is at 120 plus 3. I'm too tired to do the math like this. Um, <laughs> 80 divided by 7. Or wait, by 8, actually. 47 turns, okay, but they spend okay. like, you see, the last chapter, we took like 20 turns between the second to last castle and the last one, or like 10 turns? So, something along those lines, I don't remember. Okay, so it's possible... Blah, 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 blah. Oh, she got a blank level up. Congrats, FE4 is amazing. Huh. How dare you. How oh, dare How oh, dare Dre. Um, does a cell die here? Uh, what's he doing? Standing I can't see. A... I can't see properly. S standing oh. here with an all fire. Uh, I don't know. Check the wind mage ranges. The wind mages, I'm not worried about because they they want a weapon triangle. But I'm talking about the the. He does 34 damage. Does it help if I like tell you about the weapon about like the the void gap between uh all fire and Elwind again, or are you just no. gonna forget again? Okay, I'll just not tell you then. Uh, but how, okay. So he how many armor 20... is he gonna face? Not that many actually. I think he'll be fine. Three? Yeah. That's Wait, fine. How much damage do they do? They do 25. They do not that much. Oh, okay. They will survive then if they do, if they do not that much. <laughs> yeah. Thanks. Uh, there we go. Fucking thanks. Uh, <laughs> what was I doing? I was calculating love points. You were calculating love points. You're, sh you're shipping, Mecca. That's what you're doing. Okay, they might have like 30 more than I'm currently calculating, which means they only need 350. Which means they would fall in love within 43 turns instead. Okay, that's cool. Are you gonna? I don't know if you're gonna take 43 though. I don't know if you can afford to take 43. You mean just for my turn count? Yeah, like for the tactic strength. Yeah, you're right. I mean, but it's... I, they should fall in love within 40 turns or so. That would be nice. Oh wow, that's a lot more hit than I expected. <laughs> They do 14 damage each, and he faces 3, so that means they do 42. So I think if a Wind Mage hits him along with all the Armor Knights, he would die, but he already dodged one. Yeah, and also the Wind Mages have, will have really shit accuracy against him, like really shit. Why is it, is it really shit? Because the weapon... <laughs> Matters a little bit, right? Just a little I bit? I mean, it puts it at the same as Elwin, which is decent, I guess. He also has Charisma range, I think. Or yeah, leadership. it's Charisma and Leadership, actually. I made yeah. sure of that, so... I don't know if Javelins are more accurate than Wind Magic. I don't think they are. Uh, no, I doubt it. So it should be about a 20% chance to hit him. Hey, speed, more avoid. Tour end system. Yeah. Uh, he was already safe anyway, because he's not one-rounding a mage with Elfire. No, he's definitely not. Uh, okay, no, so, definitely uh, not. So I'm just bad. How are you going to get a kill with Midir now? I probably won't. <laughs> I don't think Duke can open the bridge this turn, though. I don't think so. So we'll get one more turn to play around. So, uh, uh... So you have to move either Sigurd or Azal away to get a kill with Midir now. I do. But it's fine, I mean, I could just leave Sigurd here, right? So yeah. he can run in, yeah. Because this this is the tile you needs to stand on, right? Yes, and you probably yeah. want to move Sigurd after that, so that makes sense. Yeah. And I don't need to have, I can have Dew stand here, that's fine. You can put Dew, like, literally anywhere as long as it's closer. Yeah, here we go. 
Just and don't that, make any jealousy formations. No, I'll try not to. Because you got Lacus's here. Yeah, and she is a jealous girl. Exactly. I, we really need to, should confirm if married girls can still cause jealousy. Uh, I know they can, um, they can, like, donate love points, but we don't know if they can steal love points. Because that wouldn't make sense. I mean, she's a married woman. I mean, come on. It doesn't make sense either way. No, it doesn't. Uh, Maybe this could have been a turn where you left Midir out to dry, because uh, there's less enemies now. Oh. <laughs> yeah, I mean, I could still load a save and go back and do it if you want. Yeah, I mean, sometimes I feel stupid for saying these things after the fact, but... No, no, but I do. I, sometimes I play before you get a chance to react. Do you want me to reset? I mean, it's not going to cost me anything. Uh, sure. Uh, I mean, it, it could also be helpful to check before you reset, but whatever. <laughs> uh, I think it's, it's too late uh... now. Wait, what? Chapter 2, right? Uh... I don't know why it's so hard for you to figure out the right one. There's only two <laughs> Chapter 4 saves, only one of those <laughs> after. Okay, okay. So, you just leave Medir here, then. How about we check if he survives, or um, or we just take the hit to your survival rank, whatever you want. You can, just, you can check. Yeah, you you can make the move and then check, yeah, sure. Hey, you'll be fine. I mean, it's Midir. You could never die, right? Midir never dies. He's always I mean, been introduced as this amazing character. I mean, does yeah, he double with the Kerbo? Do we know that? Uh, if he does, he does. Uh, three weight, 16, yeah, that doubles. Oh yeah, for sure, that doubles. Okay. He won't kill the armor knight someone around unless he like, charges. Which you probably oh, will, because they're, they're slow. I mean, it might. This is might fine. Help. Okay. Uh, really making great use of my dancer this chapter. Yeah. If only dancing gave love points like it does in, I don't know, Fates. That would have been nice. That would have been really nice. Don't I mean, I guess at least it makes Claude have effectively like six six moves or something. That's about it. <laughs> That's nice. I mean, they they should fall in love pretty soon, shouldn't they? They have a pretty high love growth. Uh, Pretty high, but not amazing. They do have, a, have that combo, though. You so already did that one. Uh, yeah. do they? They have a combo, yeah. Uh, they have 190 plus one, so their their base oh, is good. Oh, Sigurd has shit. Sigurd has to talk with Claude that I need to activate. I think they get it after the Seas Castle then. Claude yeah. and Sylvia. I know they have one for sure. But yeah, they have 190 plus one, so like basically a mecha love growth, good base. <laughs> kind of growth. Good base, poor growth. It, it actually takes like um, 310. Points before they fall in love, and you get about six per turn. Three ten divided by six, uh, about fifty-one turns. So they can't fall in love within one chapter. But they also got some last chapter. So basically, so, they'll fall in love with him like one full chapter. And yeah. So down. what are we doing with Levin until like? Are they? There's no more gold for them to really pick up. I mean, they can visit this. No, no. So, wait, isn't That's this Sylvia's. is the build? The, oh my God! I'm so moron. I'm, I'm, I'm so, so moron. moron. I'm, I'm so, so moron. You have the title right there. Uh, <laughs> I'm so moron. I'm so moron. 